Greetings, people of the world! Matthew back with you for the continuation of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past. So, having successfully completed the first of the palaces and completed the first of the tasks of getting the three pendants required to get the Master Sword, it's now time for us to continue on our journey and get ourselves a heart to refill our health meter since we're restarting after saving. Alright, so let's be on our way. So, where we want to go next is... We want to go to where the blue pendant is in the desert, but we need to get something important before that. So, let's go and get it. And since we also have the Pegasus shoes, we can just run through these guys like nobody's business, and hope that we don't <laughs> crash into too many things. So let's keep moving. Now, I think having the Pegasus shoes definitely goes a long way. I also want to demonstrate something over in this path. So over here... We have a boy playing a flute. And he's going to keep playing it, actually, because he only stops playing it once we scatter the animals and we get right up to him. And he disappears. Yeah, you can keep him playing as long as you don't get too close to him and the animals don't scatter off. But you didn't know that, huh? But to be honest, I didn't know that either. I just found that out now. <laughs> So, you found it out just like I did! Come on, you stupid guard! Take the- Ah, thanks a lot, you cost me the bomb! The freak! Eh, it doesn't matter. We'll get more bombs along the way, I'm certain. Alright, so we're back on the outskirts of Kakariko Village, and we're on our way to get a particular item that we need to gain access to the next palace. And it's right here in the library. Remember this green book on top of the shelf? The only way we could get it is by using the Pegasus Shoes. It knocks the book off the shelf, and we've now got it. You found the Book of Medora. You can use it to read the ancient language of the Hylia. So now that we have it, let's go and use it. So let's go now to... When we have to go around those stones, and we have to go all the way over there. Alright, so it'll be a bit bit of a trek, but we can do it. Nothing we can't handle. If I'm facing the right direction, of course. <laughs> yeah, well, it always helps if you're facing the correct direction. Ah! Oh, get away from me. Go, 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 Link, go! Alright. Yeah. <laughs> I got him perplexed, like, what? just happened. Well, that's what just happened. And so did this. Oh, go, go! Alright, uh, now... Okay, there's nothing I need to do by going directly south first before I continue. Hopefully I will not run into many traps. Because, yeah, you just saw a guard there trying to do a little stealth move on me. What I want to do is in here. First, want to move these blocks in order to get access to this chest. And we've now got some more bombs. So now we want to go out and come back in in order to let the blocks we set. And then... We want to change the way we push the blocks so that I can go through this door. Ah, oh, crap, it's an anti-fairy. Oh, please stay away from me, anti-fairy. Come on, pull, pull, pull. Oh, I got hit. I got hit just as I was pulling the gate down. So I took a bit of damage and lost a little bit of magic. But it was worth it. We got ourselves some heart con another piece of heart. So that's definitely helpful. Alright, so we want to go this way. Maneuver our way through the whoa! Hello there, sneak attack stone. Nothing to say, huh? Maybe this sign provides information? Pay no attention to the average middle-aged man standing by this sign. Leave him alone. It's gotta be a trick. You can just tell. Oh, look out. Okay, I wanna go in here. And here's why. We have a lovely fairy here. I will soothe your wounds and comfort your weariness. Close your eyes and relax. And... When I open my eyes, she's disappeared, but I have full health. So I guess it was worth it, huh? 
I mean, she wasn't a thief, she didn't take any of my rupees at all. So that's good. So into the desert. I believe there's also some extra goodies around here somewhere, if I remember correctly. All I need is this vulture to back off. And for that, cow skull and bones to not be blocking my path. What's up here? Gotta hang it right, huh? Oh, we have an old man. Aha! It is the Book of Adora. With it, you can read the language of the Hylia people. Yeah, we already knew that. Really? That's all you have to say? Well, that's kind of disappointing. Why did I come in here then? <laughs> hey, that's what happens when you haven't played a game for a long time. Alright, here we go. Into the desert. Officially. Whoa! Look out! We got various things chasing us, and that's never good. But we want to... Maybe... Ha-ha! <laughs> Get it again? Gotcha! So, we've come to this little plaque here with these three ugly statues. And we have a little text here that is untranslatable. Unless... We use the Book of Adora. Oh. Oh, come on, am I gonna use it or not? To open the way to go forward, make your wish here and it'll be granted. Hmm, I wonder... What could we possibly want? And with that, the statues start moving around. There's just one catch. Now that our path has been opened, this path has been closed off! Why would you do that, game?! What if I have to get out of here? Then what are you gonna do? You need a cheap skit like that on me, huh? Haha! <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I get the feeling that all these goodies will be helpful at some point. Oh yes, I remember you. I remember you too well. Ah, crap! Get us through. Okay. I'm gonna buy my time over here and wait for him to go down. I'm gonna hang on, start by hanging on the left first. I wanna make sure I cover all my bases. A charge! Alright. Get rid of you. I'll get rid of you by not looking at you. <laughs> I love that when that happens. Oh, crap. We're under attack here. I believe lamps are the lamp is required for this. I'm going to play a little bit of chicken with a... Oh, that doesn't do anything? What was the point of that? Well, that sucks. Well, let's go with the boomerang for now. And we'll get a few extra rupees, a few extra arrows, because we could certainly use those. Yeah, no sneak attack on me or else you're gonna pay the price. Well, you can attack those things. That'd be a good idea to still be attacking those things. Like I said, I don't care what these things are called, I just want to beat that crap out of them. Oh, and I got a double play! Nice! That's what I'm talking about. That's thing left. Oh, gotta play trick again. Gotta play tricks with a crazy laser eye. But hey, if we get more treasure, I'm not gonna complain about it. What else is in here? Oh! I got some of my magic meter back. Rupee, a blue rupee, another heart. Draw the fire again. Let him do what he has to do. More arrows, more rupees, and go. Oh, the big key. The big chest. Well, I guess we'll have to wait until later to come back. Oh, still firing, firing! Still firing! <laughs> Alright, let's go this way then. Oh! I got the key, but at what price? Whoa! A narrow escape! <laughs> yeah, if 
It only counts as a narrow escape if Link is turning the right direction. I get the feeling I'm gonna need to wake you two up. Well, not you, but... Come on, ugly. I missed! Are you kidding? That sucks. Well, let's try and get you for real this time. Come on. Take that. I got you so bad. And I get my heart back. Thank you. Boom! And we're up to 30. There we go. We got the map. Alright. Let's keep on going. And I got the feeling we have to take a right here. I hear a lot of sounds, but they can't be good sounds. Uh, oh! Nuts. Oh, another wrong way. I'm gonna figure this out, don't you worry. Okay, open the door. Uh, oh, the laser always provides an intimidation factor. There's always that fear factor when you got the spinning eye with the laser that can shoot at you if you cross its path. And now we have the compass. Alright. Goodbye me. Oh, gotta make a huge move, or maybe not. Oh, we already have the big key. Wow, already? Oh, <laughs> that's not gonna happen twice. <clears throat> Alright, let's go this way. Now we want to go up, back up. And I want to go over here. So... Oh no, that's right, I need to go to the far left, not the far right. Don't worry, I'll get this. I got, oh, 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 crap, 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 I got stuck on the corner of the sand! Or stuck on the corner of the mud! Ugh, that's not what I wanted to have happen. And I was not actually expecting that to occur. You got the power glove. You can feel strength in both hands. You can pick up and carry stones now. Which is good. Oh, need to hit the switch again. Very well. Hey, hey, go, go, go. Alright. Now what do I take this thing? Maybe Sir Hasrallah has some info? Link, it is I, Sir Hasrallah. You must never fail to find all the treasures in each dungeon. Well, th thanks for that advice, but I already kind of knew that. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to go. But to where? But to where shall we go? Oh, wait a minute. What's the point of being in here? Other than to get my world rocked. Oh, stay away, stay away, stay away! Uh. Oh, a heart, heart, heart! Give me the heart, give me the heart, give me the heart, give me the heart! Yes! Got it! Come on. No, 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 no! Oh! <laughs> so it's just a trap room and nothing more. Well, thanks a lot. Well, I gotta advance somewhere around here. Not there. Go! I'm back in the main chamber. Is there anything of relevance up this way? No, apparently not. Uh... Okay, so I get the feeling I have to go outside maybe and go back in. Ow! Oh no! That counts as one hearts of damage and that's game over. Well, at least I know what to do. At least I hope so. So, there's my first game over. Yeah, I was trying so hard to get out of the way that it didn't work. Perhaps I'll play it a bit more cautiously here. That would be a good idea. It would be a very good idea. 
we're gonna figure our way out through this. Just you sit back and watch. Hopefully. Hopefully I'll find the answers I seek. And I went the wrong way again, didn't I? Yeah, as I always said, when you haven't played a game in a long time, it's easy to forget where stuff is. Hopefully, all goes well. Go, 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 go. Gotcha. Rupees won't help, hearts will. <coughs> I want to go down here, I suppose. Or do I? I'm trying to remember how, that's, how that works. Is it a block that I have to push? I'm sure it's... I've got to push one of these blocks somehow. There it is. Now I need to dodge the eye again. Oh, we have fairies. Okay, um... Quick, quick. Uh, use the bug catching net. Put that bug catching net to good use. Got it! Get the other one? Get the other one. Got the other one. Alright. Fine by me. Uh, that that would have helped a lot sooner, wouldn't it have? Um, let's go back to the boomerang. Okay. Yeah, I, I think you do have to go outside and then back in through an alternate location. Yes, this is what we needed the power glove for. Alright, now into the second part of the Desert Palace. And once again, we're pushing blocks. Try and avoid the fire. Stay away from the fire, there we go. And onward. Oh, I remember this section. Got to avoid the crazy tiles. Got me a heart. Stay away from the scary scary. I'm not even gonna bother with anything else, we're just gonna... Open the ch key and move on. Now, why would they put this... Why would they make this room the way that they did? It's per it's a bridge, but there's no way out of it, and you can't jump off. That that's very weird. At least I think it's very weird. If you don't think it's weird, put it in the comments and let me know. Okay, just stay clear, please. It, come on. Get those crazy uglies. There we go. We can move on. And more crazy uglies. Not gonna bother about the rupee because it's only one. Okay, slide through the slum. Ow! Two thero two lasers, two lasers. Uh, get through, get through. Ow! Ow! Uh, I gotta find another key. Oh, he could still hit me from there. No fair. Crap. No! Well, at least I got those two fairies just in the nick of time. And I'm gonna have to burn one. Yeah, it doesn't matter now, does it? I got the heart and it meant nothing! Nothing! Oh, now I gotta play crazy guess where his stuff is again game. Ugh. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Go, go, go. Here we are. Oh. This section. Got to remember how to... I think in this circumstance, he moves where you do. If I remember correctly, it'll... Or, I don't... Or maybe not yet. Get him? Okay. Alright, so now I have to light these. This I do... Uh, no, this much I do remember. And then that pulls the wall back. Just enough to reveal a hole for the big key. Thank you very much. Boss time. Oops, no, I don't want to use that. Um, I want to uh, make sure that I don't get hit by their their stuff, their mud when they go by. I also want to make sure I score a hit on them. Okay, there we go. 
Looking good. Yeah, all I have to do is just keep the charge ready and... Oh, that one doesn't count. Make sure I do it right. Oh, it also has some help if I don't get the timing down. Yeah, just let them do what they gotta do. Gotcha. Stand by. I missed. Try it again. There we go. Yeah, just come right into my traps. That'll help me win and help you lose. Gotcha. And again. Oh, that one didn't count. I missed. There we go. Whoops. Not that time. Come on, baby. Ah, cop off by the mud again. Gotcha that time. Oh, I got hit by more mud. Okay, I was not expecting that. Okay, they're still hitting me with the mud. No fair. Okay. I do fear things are going awry here. There we go, there's a score. Gotcha that time. Uh, okay, there's one. One is down. Two more to go. Oh, it's time to... Okay. Come on. Oh, he turned away from me. Oh, you little cheapskate. I'm gonna get you for that one. There, I gotcha. Okay. We're doing well. At least I think we're doing well. Oh, come over here. Got you there. Should almost have it. Oh! Okay, there's two. There's two down. One more to go. Almost got this. And there it is. It's over. As I'm down to one heart left, but it doesn't matter because I'm getting a full refuel thanks to the full heart. And I'm going to get the pendant dropped right into my hands. Thank you very much. <laughs> that is two of the pendants obtained. You won the pendant of power. I thought the pendant of power was the red one. Oh, whatever. Your goal of finding three pendants is in sight. Go for the last one. And with that, we have now got two of the three pendants. Well, the last pendant is going to be quite the tricky one to obtain, because it's all the way up there on the fabled Death Mountain. So we're going to take a quick time out, and we'll be back to go after it in just a moment.